So hey, it's me again, driving into work. Thought I'd uh, share something with you. And you know, I got an email over the weekend. You know that horrible thing that happened in Kansas City, Javon Belcher uh, killing his girlfriend who was only 22 years old, leaving their three-month-old baby without a mama and a daddy because then he killed himself. And yesterday, uh, before the uh, Chiefs game in Kansas City against Carolina, uh, they had a moment of silence for victims of domestic abuse. And someone sent me an email saying that if Javon Belcher would have been white, they would have said something about him. And I was like, really, you're gonna make this a race thing? This is a race thing now, really? I'm thinking, okay, first of all, you're wrong. Second of all, you know, I feel bad for Javon Belcher's family. You know, I do, but Javon Belcher is a murderer. And I feel bad saying that, but it, it's the truth. He killed his girlfriend. He killed her, he shot her more than once. My understanding is he shot her multiple times. Uh, before, you know, he turned the gun on himself when he went down to the Kansas City Chiefs uh, facility, their offices and stuff like that. But you can't, you can't mention really Javon Belcher. There's really, other than may he rest in peace and that you pray for his family because what he did was horrific. What he did was horrible. You know, uh, some people say it all came from because she got home late from a Trey Songs concert. That ain't why he shot her. I mean, come on. He didn't shoot her for that reason. That dude snapped. I don't know what it was. I have no idea. You can speculate all you want, but you have no idea what caused him to do that. You don't shoot somebody from before coming or go, even going to a train song, any concert, or coming home late from one, as some people were saying on the internet. You just don't do that. Something else triggered what happened. I don't know what it was. You don't know what it was. What I will tell you is this, is that we, they, you know, also, some people were saying, like on CNN, they were saying, well, how come they didn't mention the girl's name uh, at the Chiefs game, the, the young lady who got who was murdered? How come they just mentioned domestic violence victims? And I'm, to me, I'm like, really, y'all splitting hairs like that now? Do you know how many people, how many people are victims of domestic violence each and every minute in this country? So they didn't mention her name. You know, M maybe her family didn't want her name mentioned like that. I, I don't know. I don't know. But... Come on, really? We're going to criticize the Kansas City Chiefs for saying, you know, we take a moment of silence to honor victims of domestic abuse rather than point out this young lady's name? Come on, y'all. We, we're better than that, right? It's a horrible situation. It, it, it shouldn't have happened. Uh, some people are say Bob Costas last night said on uh, during his commentary during the football game that if we had stricter gun laws, this wouldn't have happened. Well, I, I, I tend to want to believe him, but honestly, you don't know that. You don't, you don't, you don't know for certainty that that wouldn't have happened. You just don't know. I mean, you can't predict. You know, what ifs? What ifs are nothing but what ifs at the end of the day, right? They're they're not based on fact. They're just based on speculation. So I don't know about that. I understand he's getting heated up on uh, on Twitter and social media today for his comments. But at the end of the day, what Javon Belcher did was murder his girlfriend. You don't get honored for that. You know, uh, the best we can do is, like I said, pray for him. May he rest in peace. Uh, pray for his soul. Pray for his family. That's really all that you can do. I just, I don't understand some people. It's not a race thing. If he were white, they would have honored him like yesterday. Are you crazy? <laughs> Are, were they going to put their number on, his number on their helmet or, or a patch on their, on their uniform for a man who killed his girlfriend and then himself? Come on, man. Think about that for a second.